This year, on June 28th and 29th, is the 16th anniversary of the Abu Slim prison massacre. What happened in Abu Slim prison 16 years ago is relatively known. You know, they basically gunned down 1,200, a uh, bit more than 1,200 prisoners. What we don't know is where they put the bodies. During the war in 2011, we went back to Libya. Very restricted trip because the state didn't let us move. But after much pressing, they let us into Abu Slim. And it was tense. We got to speak with six prisoners, but they chose them. The prisoners were terrified um, and uh, didn't speak. Two weeks later, Muammar Gaddafi's regime crumbled. Uh, Tripoli fell, and we went straight back. It's the outside of Abu Slim prison, a notorious political prison in Tripoli. Prisoners were released about a week ago. Broke themselves free. The team of lawyers is trying to secure the documents that remain. And tragically, these rooms have been burned. Burned files that are Libya's history and potentially crucial evidence for any judicial proceeding. The post-Qaddafi government is interested to investigate this case, both for political reasons and for justice. So uh, they've started an investigation, but they have to do it properly, they have to do it fairly. I hope that a judicial process and the trials will reveal the fate of these victims and help close the book on this terrible tragedy.